Hi, boys and girls. We're going to learn about the sounds and writing letter P. Okay. And we have a learning target that we say in class. It says, I am learning the letter P so I can read and write. P says, P, 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 like pear. You hear the P at the beginning of pear and like in top. You hear the P at the end of top. So this is capital P. This is oh, lowercase descending P. Okay, because the bottom of the P goes down into the basement. Okay, and this is pear. Some other words that start with p are peach, pen, piano, pie, my favorite, and pig. And some words that end with the p sound are sheep. And soup. Okay, that's the p sound for letter P. Now we're going to practice writing letter P on a whiteboard with lines, on a whiteboard without lines, and on lined paper. Okay, here we go. I'm going to make my whiteboard bigger and make smaller. And remember, boys and girls, our song it says, Where do you start your letters? at the top. Where do you start your letters at the top? If you're going to write a letter, then you better, better, better remember to start it at the top. And on our lined whiteboard, this is the top. We're going to write capital letter P. Start at the top, dive down, frog jump, little speaker. Base, start at the top. Dive down, frog jump, little seeker. And little p, sorry, lowercase p, is similar to capital P, but we start on the midline right here. We all start at the top, and it sounds like this. Dive down into the basement, swim back up and over, close it. Again, on the midline, at the top, Dive down into the basement, swim back up and over, close it. Do you see how Mrs. Harris is holding her marker? I'm not holding it like this. I will not write correctly like that. I hold it like this. Okay, I'm going to turn my whiteboard over. And this is what capital P looks like on a blank whiteboard. Dive down. Oh, let me start that again and use the correct words. Here we go. Big line down, frog jump, look backward seeker. Again. Big line down, frog jump, backward seeker. And now we're going to write a lowercase p. Dive down into the basement, swim back up and over, close it. Again. Down into the basement, swim back up and over, close it. Do you see the difference? Capital P stands up tall, lowercase p dives down into the basement. Now we're going to try it with paper and pencil. Let me make this bigger so you can see it better. Focus. All right. And this is my paper I'm using to practice writing all of my letters that I know. Okay. So we're starting at the top. Big line down, frog jump, backward seeker. Again, big line down, frog jump, backward seeker. Now down here, I'm going to start on the midline. It's still at the top. Then I'm going to dive down into the basement, swim back up and over, close it. Okay, this is lowercase p. Again, dive down into the basement, 
Brooklyn back up and over Clover. All right, boys and girls, that is how we practice writing capital P and lowercase p. And P says p, 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 like in piano and pear at the beginning of the word. And it says p, 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 like in top, excuse me, like in top and in stop at the end of a word. Thanks for working with me.